How to join paths in Adobe Illustrator. So I have these two paths here and you can see that there's anchor points here that aren't connected or they're not joined. So I'm going to put those together here. I'm going to select this guy uh, with the selection tool, but I'm going to switch here to the direct selection tool so I can grab the actual anchor point. And then you can see I've got the whole thing, but this anchor point is going to snap. See that white uh, arrow that happens there? Uh, so that thing is now they're right on top of each other. I can go to object, path, and join and now they're as if I drew it like that they're permanent I'm gonna undo here command Z a couple times I want to show you another uh, technique that you might need to, you know depending on what project you're using or uh, doing sorry uh, I'm gonna just gonna grab the the top anchor point here not not this one I'm gonna copy paste command C command B I'll bring this guy over here I'm gonna use the reflect tool vertical axis cool same thing uh, with the direct selection I'm going to grab that anchor point I'm going to put it right on this anchor point I'm going to select those two object path join those are done I'm going to paste another one command V this time I'm just going to use the transform tool and grab it move it on whoops oh yeah no it'll work <laughs> I was looking at the other side and join command j or object path join and then we can just grab the whole thing hit the old direct selection tool join these paths object path join or over here same thing command j and now you've got this watch let's, let's uh switch that it's all joined up just like you drew the thing together. Obviously, in this case, you can make just a rounded rectangle, but uh, whatever you, it is you're working on, you're probably going to need it for something more complicated than that, and that's how you do it. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and have a good one.